Good evening. And welcome to our annual All City Band Concert. My name is Kevin Vargas, and I'm one of the associate principals here at the high school. We could be happier that you're here tonight. As we mentioned before, if you could please make sure your cell phones are off and your flash photography is off as well. That would greatly, greatly help our performers this evening. Tonight, I am thrilled to be your MC. The theme for our concert tonight is travel. Tonight, we'll be journeying near and far, boarding ships, going through traffic jams, and even flying with music and various people and various cultures. The first stop in our traveling journey is more about the destination than the journey itself. Jamaican Holiday is a traditional Jamaican folk song that is a reminder of the beauties of the West Indian Islands. This song was made famous and recognizable in the United States when Harry Belafonte used the folk song in Jamaican Farewell. In the Bowl at sixth grade band's representation of the song, you will be transported to a beautiful island featuring the melody and the woodwind instruments. Under the direction of Mrs. Amy Burtleff, here is the sixth grade band from Bullock and Cook. No city has been more important to the development of American music than New Orleans. In the 19th and 20th century, New Orleans was host to musical styles from across the globe, and this unique mixture led to the creation of the blues, of early jazz, which are two of the most uniquely American styles. Conducted by Mr. Jim Lang, here's the Robert Sixth Grade Band to take you on a musical trip down the Mississippi with tonight's selection, the New Orleans Strong.
the traveling itself can sometimes be the worst part of the journey, oftentimes it can be quite memorable. The Bullock 7th grade band will help you imagine something we can all emphasize with. An annoying traffic jam. Imagine yourself on a busy highway, white knuckle gripping the steering wheel. This pragmatic piece is meant to represent car horns honking, police monitoring the busy roads, and stressful aspects of traffic, all while enjoying some jamming blues figures. Thank <laughs> you. 
everyone, we would like to invite everyone, excuse me, to participate in our, one of our largest fundraisers for the music program throughout the district. On Friday, April 1st, it's no joke, at SYB Party Center in Stowe, the instrumental music patrons will be hosting a reverse raffle. Tickets are $40 each, they include a buffet, a buffet dinner, and your number on the big board. Doors open at 6, and the raffle is going to start at 7. It is guaranteed to be a very fun evening. Be sure to look for more information in the coming weeks so you can purchase your tickets and support the worthwhile cause. Proceeds from this event go to the general fund of the instrumental music patrons to support all band students in the district. Without further ado, in coastal cities, a wonderful tradition that has established itself is the appearance of the tall ships during the summer. These tall ships are gorgeous crafts that are frequently accompanied by a beautiful fireworks display. As the tall ships enter in the harbor of the city, the feeling of patriotism and pride rings throughout your body. Entrance of the tall ships, performed by the eighth grade band students from Bolt Middle School, takes this feeling of pride and mixes it with a fun,
music and dance narrative to Cuba. Mambos incorporate many elements that are common to Latin American and Afro-Cuban music that often feature a wide variety of percussion instruments. The Roberts 8th grade band will feature our percussion section this evening with James Swearing's exciting piece, Mambo Cubano. So now the freshmen take the stage. The freshmen are going to be taking us to Boston tonight, performing an arrangement of a well-known tune, I'm Shipping Up to Boston, which was recorded by Dropkick Murphys in 2005. After appearing on the soundtrack for the Academy Award-winning film, The Departed, the recording has been frequently used at the New England Patriot Games, in TV commercials, and NHL video games. You may recognize the song from its affiliation with the Disney movie Brave, other groups such as the Boston Pops Orchestra, the University of Massachusetts Minutemen Marching Band have also played their own renditions of this piece, conducted by Miss Courtney Lambert. Here is the freshman band performing I'm Shipping Up to Boston.
National Landmark in Colorado Springs, Colorado. This public park is famous for its red rock formations, and its vast Native American history. While on vacation, composer Rick Kirby was inspired to write a piece about the magnificent rock features and the peaceful quietness he experienced there. His composition describes a day in the park when Native American communities flourish there, the picks of a peaceful sunrise, tumultuous thunderstorm, the clearing of the skies, and a beautiful sunset. Under the direction of the talented Mr. Dustin Harris, here is the Gold Concert Band performing Garden of the Gods.
Vigiani's pragmatic piece of music suggesting a day in the life of an African village. The day breaks peacefully and quietly. As the villagers awake and begin their daily chores, the bustling village becomes filled with activity. A celebration breaks out, complete with dancing, singing, and jubilant drumming. As the intensity of the celebration grows, the tempo increases, leading to a frenzied and joyful conclusion. Here is the Black Concert Band conducted by Miss Jennifer Culver.
performance this evening. As we prepare for our final performance this evening, I would like to thank everyone for coming tonight on behalf of every student, teacher, administrator, and community member here in Cuyahoga Falls and supporting our instrumental music in our schools. Our music program is one of the finest in the area. We're all extremely proud of the work that every student does. It takes many things to make this program successful, and the directors are grateful to the parents, administration, and community for supporting our students on their quest for musical excellence. As you leave tonight, there will be parents from the instrumental music program at the exits in the hallways to receive any donation you may be interested in making to the program. All donations go directly to support our students throughout through instrument repair and maintenance, the purchase of music, and supplemental instruction. In Flight is a pragmatic piece that was commissioned by Lincoln High School in Indiana in 2001. Musical suggestions in the piece mimic qualities of piloting a fighter jet in combat, as well as the serenity of the sky as the plane climbs higher, breaking through the clouds and having a feeling of weightlessness. The piece is meant to convey an exciting, uplifting feeling that is associated with the beauty of flying. We conclude tonight's performance with a symphonic band conducted by Mr. Dustin Harris. <laughs> 